fun hour lined up with extremely innovative and clever, clever things for your home. One of these, we had this on the other night, and what happened was, we had brought in uh, about, I think it's like 5,000. In two airings, we sold out of every single one. So literally today, our buying team was absolutely scrambling. Yeah, it's crazy. To scrambling the other night to bring in more, and we've got them in tonight. We literally have enough for this airing coming up. And I'll tell you what, this is such a gem of a little heater. You literally plug it into an outlet. That's all you have to do, and it can heat a room brilliantly. So we'll talk about that. Don't don't miss out. Chance Start's going to sell out again tonight, and it's a really fun item. Now, here is my go-to ultimate gift idea for anybody on your list. If they have a car and they've got a uh, phone, this is the one that you absolutely want to get for them. And what it is, it is the uh, Clever Grips. Um, last Christmas, I bought at least five sets, and we only offered a two-pack. Now we're offering a... Where's my umbrella? A three pack, sorry guys, it's live TV and they're hiding things on me, here we go. So now we're offering a, well you know it's live, what do you do? Um, we're offering a three pack tonight. The price is amazing on this too. We just got it all set up for you. And we really do have a fun hour. I've got a couple other items that are really, really clever, clever ideas for gifts. So we'll get to all that. Sorry, it is live folks. So that's what happens when you're doing live television. All right, the first item up, um, I had the pleasure of launching. And you know, when you think of an umbrella, you're like, she's gonna talk about an umbrella? Well, you probably might not have seen this. It is the smarter, more brilliant, better umbrella. And when we launched this, I believe we sold somewhere in the 75,000 range on the very first day it went on the air. It is completely different than anything you've ever seen because it opens up unlike any other umbrella out there. Oh my gosh. So we've got a lot to get to. Here's the scoop. I have black. We've sold over a hundred hundred thousand but on that first launch it was like 50 70 thousand it was insane how many we sold on the very first day we put it on the air and it's back tonight unfortunately though this is the final quantities for the whole holiday season and we think it's going to sell out so i'm gonna get Lori leland to return with me to talk yeah. about this fabulous umbrella oh my you gosh know. what a great invention you know the umbrella so hasn't smart. really changed in like thousands of years and the only reason we really put up with the umbrellas that are out there right now is because it's the only alternative with the better umbrella there really and truly is a better way this is reverse open and close technology. So you're going to be able to close down that umbrella after it's raining cats and dogs and then look at this. Everything that comes in contact with you, everything that comes in contact with your vehicle, your clothing, your car, it's all bone dry. This creates a waterproof comb that captures all of the water for you. Then it can easily evaporate through the little perforated design or you can simply shake it out later. So look at this. Here's the solution on your left. That better umbrella folds in on itself. We've taken that traditional umbrella turned it upside down, inside out, so that your car interior doesn't get soaked and doesn't get wet. I love this design. It is so smart. It has a giant canopy on it, 41 and a half inches. And look at that. You can get in and out of your vehicle in about two inches of space. It is pretty much the smartest thing we have ever seen. Talk about a great gift to give for this holiday season. Yeah. Have you ever noticed? You get more wet with a traditional <laughs> umbrella than sure if you do. didn't even have one at all. With better umbrella, there really and truly is a better way. And look at the beauty beautiful styling and detailing. And it's really great quality really too. Really like, nice. It's shocking uh, the price is only 24 and some change because exactly. it's such nice quality. And also, it you can put a lot of folks under here. You know how sometimes you get those umbrellas and they're so wimpy and like your back's wet or your toad over your back, the back of your toad or your handbag's wet? Right. This gives you great coverage and boy, I'll tell you what, the minute you use this to get into your car and you are not wrestling your stupid umbrella to get it inside, you will go, I'm so glad I have this. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to love this. So look at this double canopy design. So it's super durable. This will withstand winds up to 24 miles per hour. So this, like you said, it feels really, really well made. Look at what you're seeing on the inside. Actually, look at what you're not seeing. There is no exposed metal here. So I love the fact that it's all nice and smooth. No metal to grab your hair, to pull or tug at your clothing, to snag your sweater. And then look at this. So here I am. I'm going to go inside the house. All you do, you can bring yourself mostly in. You simply touch that button, draw it in, and instead Instead of water dripping everywhere, you can set this down. With that waterproof cone, it contains all of the water. When the rain stops later, you simply shake it right out. Or again, that perforated design will help some of that water evaporate, but you're not
not puddling or pooling on your carpets, on your hardwood floors. It doesn't make a big mess. Think about this, in and out of your car. We all know you can stay dry under a typical umbrella walking to your car. It's when you get oh. in your car. It takes <laughs> this much space. The right. door has to be open this wide for you to pull the umbrella in. You can pull the better umbrella in in about a two inch space and you're covered the entire time. So you're never getting wet. The inside of the door isn't dripping wet. You know what the flavor for me is? Opening the door in a rainstorm. Right, oh like yeah. Like when you open the car yes, door. Yes. So normally you have to put that baby wide open and then again, you're wrestling with your umbrella and you're trying to get it open. Here, all you do is you barely open it. Right. You stick the darn thing out your car door and then it opens the above your car and your car door. That's exactly it. And then it. you step out you're and actually the whole time. you feel kind of like a little bit of a smarty pants. Yeah. Because you're just like, this is so awesome. It I is. It's so I didn't get brilliant. soaking wet and my car interior didn't get soaking wet either. The only thing you have to remember is I've got less than 2,000 of these. This is the last and final airing. We don't have any more in stock right now. So if you really want to give somebody a clever aha gift. So you cool. You ever get this time of year and you're just like, oh gosh, not a sweater. What am I going to buy somebody? They're so hard to buy for. Everybody will love this. Everyone. If you've got somebody off to campus and they're having to walk through all that rain, it's a brilliant idea. Um, also, too, if you got mom or dad and you just don't know what to get them, get them an umbrella. Everyone can use umbrella. one, but get them a better umbrella. It comes with the carrying case, too. I love this. I do, too. Because literally, you just put it over your shoulder. It's very convenient. So you get the case that just slips right in there. I love that sleeve. It actually detaches, so you can put this over your grocery cart. You can put it over your um, your stroller if you've got a baby. That's what we do all of the time. But look at the other alternatives out there. So look at a traditional umbrella. This thing is a rickety mess. This is was nearly $25, so almost the exact same price. Look at all the exposed metal. This thing is rickety. You know what's going to happen with the, when this hits any wind whatsoever? It's going to tulip oh, backwards totally fall and be completely useless. Look at this thing with all of that metal. Wait, it's only look how one much it doesn't price. come. Right here, you open that one. Well, look, I'm gonna when open you close this one. it too, look, it, that water's gonna go everywhere because it's not containing it. Look at this. Look at this difference. Oh my gosh, so much bigger. The better umbrella, 41 and a half inch diameter. So it keeps you covered. And like you said, keeps your purse covered, your groceries. You can walk with sure. your husband underneath it. This thing, my gosh, this is gonna end up right in the trash, isn't it? Yeah. And oh, then yeah. let's talk about the others out there as well. So here's one of the other old school style umbrellas. This gave you good coverage, but it's only a single ply. Again, nearly 25 dollars for this one as well. Here's the problem. All of this is getting wet with the rain that's coming down and then you have to close <laughs> it down and all that water rolls all over you. You poke yourself in the eye with the end, edge of it's it. It's dripping everywhere. It's a real pain in the neck. This is the worst possible <laughs> way with better umbrella. It's a much better design. It makes so much more sense and it's going to keep you drier and shouldn't that be the whole point of an umbrella? To keep you drier? Yeah. And it's fun because once you get it at home, you're going to be like, this is so smart. And, and don't you think, Lori, it's true? You don't realize how truly clever it is until you're stuck in bad weather. And by the way, that could be sleet. You know how many of you live in a big city and, oh, isn't it nasty when it's the middle of winter and you get that awful cold sleet and you need your umbrella for that? This is so clever. So even in the middle of the winter when you pull your umbrella out for that sleety day, right, right. you actually will just go, oh my gosh, this is so brilliant. And like when you're, we, we showed some video where they're showing the twirly doors you get in big cities, you know, oh, the sure. ones that the automatic the rotating door. The rotating door. Yes, and then, revolving door. Have you That's ever it. tried to get you catch the door in time to get in it, and then your umbrella jams the entire door and breaks right. because you couldn't get it in time and closed. With this, you're not gonna have to get wet. You literally catch it, go in, and you step into that revolving door, and it's not an issue. Can well, I do we bring it? rain? Yeah, put yours up, and I just wanna show everybody, <laughs> we're doing a recreation because we're doing it inside, but look at this. So of course, she is covered under this giant canopy. She's not getting wet at all. Close it up, because look, there's a good amount go. of water on the top okay, of the see umbrella. The I don't know. Watch what happens. Look at this. It's captured inside the umbrella. It creates that waterproof cone so the water doesn't drip out. It doesn't get all over the place. Isn't yeah. this brilliant? And wait, so can I see? And the first, the first question I asked her was, well, if the water's in there, is it going to get mildewy and gross? And it's not. They have little vents in here. It's so perforated. it actually just dries automatically or while it's sitting around. You or just you just shake, it, shake out. it out when it gets dry outside and when you're not going to get drenched again. But again, brilliant technology. Let me show you the simple and easy to use button. So you've got this big red button right here. All you're doing 
doing is pressing it to release and then pushing up. You don't want to touch the big red button once it goes up because then it'll snap into place for you again. Double canopy here, 41 and a half inches. So a really, really nice size. It feels super durable. This could be the last umbrella you ever need to buy. You even have that ergonomic handle. I love that soft touch grip. grip. Isn't that nice? It's really nice. Feels great in the hand. I love the fact that you can close this up so easily. We've got this great little strap that's built right on here. It's got that hook and loop. So all you do is just close it right up just like this. So it's self-contained and this is all dry. Anything that's wet is going to be encapsulated on the inside. Everything that comes in contact with you, your cars, right. your clothing is completely dry. Then one of the new advancements and one of the latest things we offered was the wrist strap at the end. Is this so brilliant? Yes. And again, here's the car. Look at the old way versus is the new way. Look at how much space it takes on the right to close that traditional <laughs> umbrella. By the time you've gotten in your car, you might as well have walked in the rain. Am it's I right? so true. It's true. You're like really soaking wet. <laughs> drenched. You're soaking and you're drenched. But with the better umbrella, there's a better way. And with that great wrist strap, this is brand new for this model. All you do, slip it right on. You're going to be able to carry it around with right. you. And then that carrying case is so nice as well. Consider this as that great holiday gift to give. I was asking my dad the other day what he wants you know how men are sometimes my dad was like oh what? i don't no. want anything yeah. guess what he's getting a better umbrella and a nighthawk pen these are two things i know he's gonna love and use because they're practical presents that make a lot of sense and really we've built a better mousetrap with this if you think about the style and design of traditional umbrellas they make no sense this makes so much more sense it's the first time we've really reinvented the umbrella in thousands of years and look at that again that reverse open and close technology it really does keep you but let me ask you, do you live in Chicago or do you live in Boston? Both those places, the wind howls through downtown. You know what I'm talking? In Chicago, it's because right. of the lake effect, right? In Boston, there's water also. And the wind is crazy. So think of the nastiest winter day. Right. When it's sleety, rainy oh, snow. Yeah. Cold, oh, cold, miserable. And that wind is howling. Remember, this has the capacity to hold up to how many miles per hour wind? This will withstand 24 mile per hour wind. That's the 24 a strong miles an hour. wind. I don't know what a, what's a cat one hurricane wind. <laughs> like if you're in a one, it's around 30 miles an hour. Right, right. right? Isn't it? Oh, no, not a one. Anyway, so the whole point is, is think about this. If you've got really, if you live in one of those cities where the wind is just ripping through your town, then think about getting this because on that sleety, cold, yucky day, trust me, you're going to be so happy you have it. And then how awful, awful is it when it's already sleety and cold and windy and rainy and you're, it's such a mess. And then all of a sudden when you lower your traditional umbrella, bloop, there's just water everywhere and snow everywhere and it's on your clothes and you're wet and your hair is wet. With this, that never happens again. And the first time you use it and you're able just to slip into the door without so getting smart. totally soaking wet, you'll be like, I'm so glad I have this. Think of it as that great gift idea, as you said. Yeah, anybody who's, anybody you don't know what to get them, get them this but you have to get it before it's gone because unfortunately we are now down to everybody on the phone lines about 1500 left and we have the classic perfect black guys like it girls mm -hmm. like it it's totally unisex so i just don't want you to miss out on it before it's sold out absolutely so brilliant so ingenious so easy to use anybody who sees this is gonna wish they had it they really are it's a better much better way love that ergonomic comfort grip grip handle here with the better umbrella so it's easy to hold in your hand you're gonna love that you're gonna love no exposed metal on the inside that was one of the things that drove me crazy I looked at one like this blue one and I've had these so many times over the years that I've ended up throwing in the trash so that is cash in the trash that's an investment that doesn't last long at all when you invest in a better umbrella like I said could be the last that's umbrella true. you need to buy for years and years to come this thing always freaked me out I thought that is gonna grab my hair that's it'll pinch, your, pinch, pinch your fingers pinch your fingers mm -hmm. pull your sweaters it's a mess plus when you're closing this look at how all all of the wet parts of this umbrella just come right in on you. Right. So and then you stick it wet. in your bag. Right. And then and all that paperwork, your, bag your checkbook is like soaking wet exactly. because you stuck it in your bag because you're trying to get out of the rain. Of exactly. Course. And that's yeah. the whole point. You yeah. want to avoid the rain, but you're getting more wet closing your umbrella than if you didn't even have one in the first place. And let me show you again, getting in and out of the door. So I am completely covered. I simply touch that button. I pull it right in. None of the water drips all over my carpet, my hardwood floors. Quick, it, come out of the door too. Yeah. This is the best. Yeah, this is cool. I'll, I'll show you, you this. this so, is really okay, cool. here I am. Wait, where's the rain? Where's your rain? It's right Can over there. Can you the rain? Okay. Right over oh, there here it is. under okay. the blue umbrella. Now watch. I'm going to fake the rain. We're doing this inside, obviously. So here we go. Oh, it's raining. <laughs> it's snowing. It's sleeting. Oh, Look at this. Lori I'm Leland. totally protected. Oh, my goodness. Totally protected. It's horrible. Look at, Look at this. Wind. Wind's blowing. 
blowing, winds blowing. And look how happy and this dry you are. This is the funniest are. recreation I've ever seen in my whole life. <laughs> I am happy, I am dry. And then look at this. I and there's a lot of water on it. And there's a ton of water on there. Yeah, you, you kind of went crazy I did, oh, you know. Bit. I'm yeah. trying to recreate that it moment. It was, it was very it was cold. It was quite chilly. <laughs> so look at this. I closed it up. All of this, this entire area, all this material is dry. So you can carry this right in, close it right up, creates that waterproof cone. You have that evaporative technology right here with those vents, with that vented design. It says better umbrella, so it's really high end. It's it really clever. is cool. So that will evaporate eventually. Or like I said, when it gets a little bit better outside, you just take it out, you just give it a little shake and you're good to go. Protecting your hairstyle, your beautiful suede and leather jackets, your gorgeous skirts. You don't want to be dripping wet. This is a better umbrella. There's a better way. You stay drier. You look nicer. You're not afraid of the rain anymore. Wait, I hear a thunderstorm. My hair's no storm. It's starting to rain. Hold on. Ah, look how fast I was. <laughs> and you're nice and dry. It does open and close it actually really, does quickly. really quickly. Yeah. Really quickly. Check it out. Whoop. Good point. Isn't that okay. awesome? All this right. was the that best. That was our best attempt best to make rain. Ever inside. I love it. Thanks, Suzanne. All right. Thank you, everybody. Hey, by the way, stay on the line for it right now. How many, Steve, we have left? About maybe 900. I mean, that's about it. And we have it in the black, so that's the easy one. Uh, you can give it to anybody. What a great gift idea. And isn't it fun and smart and different? And you really love the quality. All right, this is, uh, up until the uh, better umbrella, the, the, um, my kind of my go-to stocking stuffer is the Clever Grip. And I now have requested it three shows in a row. <laughs> three shows in a row. It's because, number one, it's a great gift, it's a smart gift, and it makes everybody who drives a car and has a cell phone a much safer driver. It's so convenient. Right now, if you were literally to go out to my car in the parking lot out back, um, and you were to um, look at my car, you would see my gold Clever Grip sitting there. I use it every single time I step in the car. It's neat because you can use it on the road, you can use it at a rental car, you can use it at home, and you get a pack of three. Last year when we did it, you actually only got two. We've now tripled it. You have four different colors and you get matching gift boxes this year for the very first time. Okay, so the other night, I was coming into your show. And everybody throughout the day had raved about this little heater. And I hadn't seen it yet. I was like, oh, I don't know. I, I guess it's probably kind of cool. But we literally went through about 5,000 in two airings. That was it. I mean, it was on and then it sold out during my show the other evening. So what our team does, because they're pretty awesome, is they hurried up and they actually reordered a couple more to get it in for tonight's show. Now, overall, since we've launched it, we have now sold 25,000. And boy, I'll tell you, what this is amazing how this little guy can generate some serious smart heat and it just is a phenomenal price plus i want to add to that of course we have uh three flex pays for under ten dollars to try this out luke caputo welcome back hello how are you oh my goodness i think this is such a gem and i was so thrilled we got more actually yeah i know they totally sold out the other day <laughs> you know what's amazing we've only been selling this like two weeks yeah it's a phenomenal, but just tells you how many people are cold out 25, there. 25,000 in two weeks. And I'm I freezing know. right now, I can guarantee you that. Well, and here's the thing. I know when people look at this, like, they're like going, wow, that is the tiniest heater I've ever seen. It may very well be, but here's the thing. It is tiny but powerful. Do not be deceived by the si uh, size of this. This is a 400 watt heater, totally self-contained. It uses a brand new technology called positive thermal coefficient ceramics. Really fancy words. Basically what it means is instead of having like a two inside of it or a metal strip that heats up it actually has a piece of ceramic inside of it that gets warm and that ceramic uses less power and when it's if it starts to get into an overheat situation it actually cuts back on the power so it never will overheat but here's the cool thing this is a full featured heater that will heat an average size room it's your personal heater you can take anywhere with you let's go to the one in front of Suzanne right here because I want to show you on top all the controls that this has. Because here's the thing, people look at this, and they think, oh, you just plug it in, it's like an air freshener. You plug it in, right. and that's all. Right. But it's not a dumb box. This is actually a smart heater. On top right here, you see there's a thermostat right there. If I press the minus button, I can set the temperature down. If I press the plus button, it sets the temperature up. Now, the neat thing about that is, just like your thermostat in your house, when it reaches whatever temperature I set, let's say I set it for 77 in degrees. In the room. In the room, right. when it reaches that temperature, or the temperature in the room reaches this, it will turn the heat off. When the temperature drops again, it will turn itself back on just like a regular space heater, okay? Then, you got a two-speed fan right here. We've got a low speed 
and we got a high speed. So if you, you know, if it's getting a little too warm, you can always just turn the fan down a little bit or turn up. Then the best thing, timer. I love this timer. I'm crazy about this because you can set this anywhere from 12 hours all the way down to one hour and everywhere in between, and it'll turn itself off after the period of time that you specify. So Suzanne, you're getting a full featured heater in something that you can hold in the palm of your hand. You could literally put it in your tote bag. Totally. <laughs> that small. Totally. And okay, so here's the story. As I mentioned, we're going through thousands every single time we air this. I have 4,500 left, and then again, this is gonna probably sell out. Uh, I was thrilled we got even a couple in for tonight's show. Here's what I loved. One of the reasons I thought this was so brilliant is how many of you have lived up north, or you live up north, and you've ever had broken pipes in the middle of winter? Yeah. And you know what you do? You're like, oh my gosh, if I only would have had a little bit of heat on those pipes in the basement. You plug this in, you set the temperature, and guess what? You get to completely forget about it. You don't even have to worry about it. So instead of having to like plug in an extension cord and a space heater and all this crazy stuff, you plug it in and then you don't have to think about it anymore. So if you are the one person who spent all that money having your pipes redone because they exploded in the middle of winter because they got too cold, oh my gosh, for you know $29.95, why not try it? And I I think that's one of many reasons why it sold so well. Oh yeah, no, well, and that, that you know, as I said at the beginning, there's a lot of people that are cold. You know, what I mean? <laughs> yes, yes. there's a lot of people that have that one drafty room, or maybe you're somebody that like works in a cubicle and your boss is like super stingy with the, the heat. heat. You know what's <laughs> funny? Every single woman, and that's not just women that have cold feet, but every woman I've showed this to has been like, oh my god, my feet get so cold in the winter. Yeah. Under yeah. their desks, and this is perfect to plug in there. Now, I got a fancy device right here. That's a thermal camera mounted to a cell phone. Oh, cool. Okay. Uh, I'm going to show you how quickly this will heat up. Because for a lot of folks out there, the last thing you want is to come in from shoveling the snow and have to sit there and wait a really long time for a heater to come on. So I'm going to pull this all the way here. In fact, I'm going to turn on there so we can see the temperature reading on it. Okay, so that's kind of neat, right? <laughs> you can see the temperature that's on there right now. Now, that's totally cold, and it says it's like 63 degrees, right? Is that what that says, or 64 degrees? 66. 66 degrees. Okay, my eyes are just horrible, I guess. Yeah, all right, watch this. I'm gonna turn this guy on. We're gonna turn it up all the way, and I want you to see how quickly it starts to heat up. Do you see how fast that's oh, going on the inside? Oh, you see the, the coils there? started. The ceramic coils started. Look at that. Yeah, there we go. I'm trying to point it on there. There <laughs> we go. There we go. Now. 132 wow. degrees and rising. 248. Yeah, and that's in less than like 30 seconds. So it comes on instantly. So you're already, and if I put my hand in front of this, I'm getting that heat. Look, my hand's not nearly as hot as that. When I pull my hand out of there, you can see. And so that just demonstrates to you how quickly that rises. Now, the other thing that's interesting too is that if you look at how blue everything else is around here, it's pretty darn cold in our it's studio. It's freezing. Just in the so studio, you know, by the if way. I take a reading on the table right here, it's like 60 something degrees. But if I point it back up on this, it's going to go up to over a couple hundred degrees on this in just seconds. So when you plug this in, you're going to get the benefits of a full-size heater without having the bulk or the drain of power because this is only 400 watts. Now, here's the thing. Um, we always talk about zone heating. Yes. Okay? And it, for those of you at home that don't know what that is, it's the whole premise that you should never really turn your thermostat up for the whole house if you're just sitting in one room. Right. It doesn't make sense. A waste of money. It's a waste of money. Well, it's just like the whole thing I say about if you're boiling a pot of water on a four-burner stove, you know, you don't turn on all four just to use one burner. It's, right. it's silly, right? It's a waste of money. This is so small, you can take this with you anywhere you go throughout the house. So when you talk about a personal heater, a portable heater, and zone heating, this is your guy. Oh, and you don't have to roll it around. No, there's you don't no have rolling. to unplug it and then pick you up this big it. unit. You literally just go boop, and in you the just palm go, of your hand. I'm going to the bedroom. Here's what I like too. Yeah. How often do you go to sleep at night and all you do is want to take the chill off? Because once you get <laughs> yes. under all the covers, you get plenty. You're nice and toasty warm. It's fine. But that first you know shot of trying right. to go to bed, you're freezing while your body warms up under the covers. Right. Use the timer so you plug yes. it in you turn your thermostat down in your house overall and then set the timer on it so maybe six hours from now by that point you're nice and cuddly warm you're fine you don't need the extra heat but you've got it also explain the room dimensions that this works in that really surprised well, me well we say an average size room on this so for most people out there it's about a 15 by 15 foot room i mean that's a this, good size this room. little guy at under yeah. 30 dollars 15 by 15 foot room yeah that's really remarkable that, and no it really is and here's Okay, you want to geek out on something? Oh, you know okay. me. I know you do. I, I totally I know you love do. geek out Okay, stuff. I'm going to show you something that to me was like one of the neatest features on this. I'm going to show you the back of this real quick. Right here is a three-prong plug. Okay, now notice that it has the post on the bottom of this. Not everybody's outlets are configured this way. So if you tried to plug this in where the post was on the top, it would fall out of the wall. Watch what we do here. You press this little button, you rotate this around, 
and now the post oh. is on the top. Hello. <laughs> that is a, I've Watch. Done, Do it I again. I didn't know you Here myself. I have to know you myself. Yeah. That was so geeky. Isn't that so cool? <laughs> That's so you, really pre smart. you press the button and you rotate it just because we know not everybody's outlet is going to have the post, you know, the, the facing down. Yeah, the, the, the ground on the, on the bottom. Sometimes yeah. it's on the top. So it's that simple. <laughs> We've really thought of everything. Now, I'm going to go to a place where you never thought I uh, really? did anybody go. No, listen to this. <laughs> BYOH. It is still early in the evening. No, no, no. Not that place. Okay. No, BYOH. Bring your own heat. Okay, so if you're going to oh, grandma's that's a house. Great idea. If you're going to grandma's house. And grandma's grandpa's really stingy. Really stingy. <laughs> bring your own heater. You don't want to walk in with a big space heater and offend everybody, but this you could put in your luggage and take bring with your you. Own heat. Right? Bring your so own heat. Funny. Why wouldn't you? So bring this with you. Or if you're going to stay in a hotel, you all know how drafty hotels can be. Bring this with you. You know, take it to the office, take it back home with you. That's the beautiful thing about this guy. They finally figured out how to put a real heater in something this tiny. It's as clever as can be. And I totally understand why it sold out. But again, we scrambled. It was a big scramble oh, yeah. to even get in enough to do this airing tonight. And we've only got a couple thousand left on it. I do think it's a great idea. But think about this. Do you have that one room in the back of a house? And boy, you have to crank up the heat in the whole house just to finally reach that back room. It could be a den. Oh, yeah. It could be a bedroom, you know, where right. your heating unit, your main heating just isn't strong enough to get there. Mm -hmm. My gosh, you don't have to do that. Just plug this in. Well, here's the thing that's very interesting about that. Even if it's not a drafty room, the last room at the end of your line for the furnace, mm -hmm. the heat can drop 60% from the time it leaves the furnace to the time it gets to that very last room. So I don't care if that's the best sealed room in the house. Right. If it's all the way at the end of the line, it's going to be cold no matter what. Now, if you're one of the folks out there and you're starting to feel the chill where you live, and the last time I looked at one of the weather maps, it was, look, well, look at it. It's so, Look at all the blue. Look at a little bit of purple up there going up toward New England. That's cold. For me, that's cold. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that's the time of year for a lot of folks when in the springtime and the fall where we kind of sit there and we go, it's cold in the morning, but it's not in the afternoon. Do I want to turn on the heater and start spending money? You don't have to with this. You can take yeah. this with you throughout the house and make yourself nice and toasty warm as you walk around. I got another geek thing to show you. You do? Really? I do. I'm going to grab one of these black pieces of uh, plastic right here. This is actually thermal reactive plastic, okay? So if I put this down in front of this unit, and this guy's on, watch what I'm gonna do here. I'm just gonna take this, I'm gonna set this on top of it. And the reason I'm doing this is, as it heats up, what's gonna happen is, this plastic is gonna start to change colors. So you'll see it. See it going right there? Oh, yeah. And what's going, you'll see the plume start to come out of this. Because remember, this, just like the furnace in your house, has a two-speed fan inside of it. So what it's doing is, it's blowing that hot air across this. So it's not like some heaters that are radiant heaters, where all they do is sit there and they just sort of get warm on their own and kind of hope the other side of the room's going to get warm. And you got to be sitting right beside yeah, it. Yeah, <laughs> no, it's not like that. This guy is going to blow that air. And you can see that spot right here. It's getting nice and warm where that's hitting it here because I'm holding it at such a severe angle. Look, even the top of it now. It just blows that air across this. That's what it's going to do in your room. It really reaches out and that's goes, okay. yeah, isn't it cool? It's, a, it's, it's just so darn smart, too. And how often have you, like, wrestled with a big old heater and you're like, yeah, right, I'm going to remove it from room to room and you don't, you never move it. It's just too bulky. This you can put in your tote. I'm also in the club where you go to your cubicle and if you have a sweater on the back of your chair or if you have a blanket <laughs> tucked in a drawer because your office is so cold, your little cube space, this is so perfect because it won't bother anybody else, but it's going to keep you nice and toasty warm in your own little space. Also, those of us who love to RV, if you RV, you know what? Again, what a really great little easy answer. Plug it in, turn it on. You've got the perfect heat because we don't need it all the time. Right. You know, you don't want to turn on and crank on the heat if you only need just a little bit. And I would bet if you live in Florida or New Mexico or California, California, oh, yeah. in some of the states that don't get bitterly cold, this might be the only thing you need all winter. I think you're probably That'd be right. Pretty interesting. Yeah. Well, I mean, and you, you know, you talk about RVs, boats. Um, there, you know, people that live in assisted living facilities, dorm rooms, studio apartments. This would be a great room. to send. A dorm room is great because you <laughs> know what? You. There's one person who controls all for the whole dorm, the heat for oh, the yeah. entire dorm, well, and you don't have access to it. They're apartment building. I lived in an apartment building in New York City where that was the case. The landlord controlled the heat, <laughs> and it was like way up. So if you're on the top of the building, you were just you sweating to death, and if you lived on the bottom, <laughs> you were freezing. So I mean, right. you know, for those of us that were closer to the bottom floor, this is something you definitely would have wanted to have. And the nice thing about this again is that you could ship this in the box. It's a it's a box about the size of this, and send it as a gift to somebody That's who great. you know is cold 
cold all the time. Speaking of which, if you're that person who's always cold, or if you right. got that one person in your family, right. okay? My feet are cold. Exactly, give this to them. They can set it down there next to their chair, wherever, turn the fan on low, and it's gonna kinda keep that heat around them. You know, there's a lot of people that fight over the thermostat, okay? Oh, yeah. This is, gonna, this, this is marital bliss in a box right here. <laughs> that is, that'll save your marriage. I think hey, so. take us through A to Z on this while we have a couple Absolutely, okay, let's take a look at this guy on the wall over here again, because now right there you're seeing that the heat radiates out of this. Remember, it has that positive thermal coefficient surrounding inside of it so it's a space age ceramic in this that heats up but it uses less power to do so all right when you look at the top of this full feature control panel on this there's a thermostat a real thermostat I can set that temperature to anything that I want from like 60 something degrees all the way up to 90 degrees it will turn off the heat when the temperature in the room the air in the room reaches that temperature that I've set and then turn itself back on again when it drops down two speed fan on this low speed high speed and then of course that great timer so so that, you know, when you first go to bed, you want to take the chill off, but in the middle of the night, you don't want to be sweating, it'll turn itself off. You just tell this how much time you want to test. Like in the on. bathroom, like if it's a winter morning, yeah. go into your bathroom, to hit that timer right. and get your bathroom nice and toasty. Then when you go in the shower and you get Perfect. out of it, you're not just freezing to death. And then it turns, yeah. and then it goes off during the day. You could be at work yeah. a couple hours later and it'll turn itself off. Well, and the other thing too, this guy's been on for a while right now, okay? Now, I can pick this up. I can hold this in my hand. I can carry this around, even though this part, the grate up here gets warm. It really does. It'll get hot, but the rest of it doesn't. So if you do want to use this in your house for what we call zone heating, carry this guy around, totally can do it. It's not going to burn your hand. So, I mean, that's, you know, just another thing they thought about when they built this. It's super brilliant. Yeah, it's smart. Okay, and here's the story. We are down to the last couple thousand available, and I have no idea if we're going to get more quantity. I would guess we're probably going to be making phone calls because it's just the beginning of November, and it's still relatively warm in a lot of places. So my guess is we're going to try to find more, but I don't know if we are or not, but I can guarantee you right now we've got them with the last couple left, a couple thousand left. Uh, two fle or three flex pays, actually under $9. And I think, you know, it'd be funny, give everybody one of these as a gift. How cute would that be? <laughs> For $10 a piece on flex pay? Yeah. Everybody's going to be so happy. Yeah, they would be. <laughs> All right, Lou, we're going to see you in about 14 minutes okay. with, as he knows, one of my all-time favorite, oh, yeah. favorite gift ideas. The Clever Grip will see that, but up next, I have a good answer for you for the kitchen. <laughs> HSN is your home for holidays. Join us this week for Hot Toys are on your kids' wish list. Check off more on that to-do list with select toys up to 25% off and flex pay. Plus, the ultimate deal finder is here. Tory Johnson has all-day deal busters that are so hot, you can't just buy one. The holidays just got easy with HSN. Visit hsn.com for more great products. plastic could make your holiday so happy just in time for gifting get $20 off when you apply and are approved for the HSN card plus extra flex offers no interest VIP financing and an additional $10 off your next purchase when you receive your new card all with no annual fees apply now call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com make HSN your home for the holidays You don't have to be a trained chef to cook a fantastic meal. The key to great cuisine starts with great ingredients, prepared in the simplest way possible. And when combined with the right kitchen solutions, cooking can be satisfying, creative and fun. I'm Curtis Stone and I'm passionate about food. Don't miss the return of Curtis Stone's Kitchen Solutions, only on HSN. Okay, so we have an entire hour of some of the most clever ideas, and really, for those hard to buy for people, really clever gift ideas. And this has to be one of those for sure. It's actually the first time I get to present it. It's one of our top 10 gifts, and you actually get two of these, plus you get a really nifty peeler to go along with it. And joining me is Mr. John Farrell. John, look at you. Hello. Yeah, uh, I know. Uh, here's what I always say about in the kitchen. People tend to want and would love to cook. They hate the prep. 
Yes, I know. Well, cooking doesn't take time. It's the preparation of the food that takes all the time. <laughs> and instead of doing it on a cutting board where you have to slice and dice and then pick it up and put it into a salad bowl, isn't it nice to be able to just slice right over the bowl? That I mean, is really this clever. Is the, this is the, the best thing about this. It's a knife and a cutting board all in one. So instead of taking the, the knife to the cutting board, we're bringing the cutting board to the knife. That so is now really brilliant. you can slice right over the top of a salad. You can dice, you can chop, you can do whatever you like and all with precision or you can go as fast or as slow as you like but I'll tell you what what's great about it it cuts just about everything but bad habits and taxes I mean <laughs> you will cut up everything in the kitchen in the in the refrigerator it's a razor sharp German stainless steel blade the cutting board is the base and it's got a dual hinge design so you'll you'll notice what dual hinges it takes all the effort out of it so it's a spring-loaded dual it does have a lock so so you can lock it shut, so you can keep it in your knife drawer, or you, it does come with a clever caddy, okay? Two of <laughs> that, those. That holds it, right? But I mean, look at all the things you can do with this, and talk about saving time. Again, cooking doesn't take time. It's the preparation of right. the food that takes all the time. And if you're sitting there with a knife on a cutting board, it takes, it takes forever because you cut it, then you have to pick it up, then you have to move it, and then you have to clean up. With the clever cutter, it all goes right into the bowl, right into the frying pan, or right into the soup pot, and I'll tell you, Here's the, the best part about it too. Because the blade goes straight down onto the cutting board like this, all right, and it's German stainless steel, you won't have to sharpen this, all right? Where a regular knife, see, oh, yeah. knives, they hit countertops, cutting boards, plates, dishes. That's what dulls the edge of your knife. All this blade ever touches are vegetables, fruit, meat, and cheese, so it stays razor sharp. So you can slice uh, just about now, every type amazing. of fruit or vegetable, right? You can slice it into on, into a salad. Yeah. If you want to do apples, bananas, kiwi kiwi fruits, pears, huh. any type of slicing or dicing that you need to do with the clever cutter, it makes it quick and simple. If you can use a pair of scissors, you can use the clever cutter. And I mean, talk about saving time. Hey, come the holidays when we're making our homemade stuffings for soups or stews. Look at this. Right into the salad bowl, you can do as much or as little as you like. You can be as precise or as quick as you want to go. It it cuts from heel to toe. The whole entire blade is razor sharp. So literally, <laughs> it cuts all the way out on the end and all the way back to the heel of the knife. So it, it, it's a precise slice each and every time. That's I mean, hysterical. It, it, what an aha idea. <laughs> I know. Like, like, why didn't I think about bringing the cutting board and a knife together in one? <laughs> well, you know, professional chefs, they spend years in culinary school trying to learn how to control a knife. Right. A lot of people don't like cooking because you don't want to do all the slicing and dicing because you're not proficient with a knife. You're right. not, you don't, you, you, people are uncomfortable using a knife. Right. With the Clever Cutter though, it takes that fear away because it does all the work for you. I mean, you can see, again, it's so simple to use. And again, uh, even for things that are really, really tough, people have a hard time, yeah. like slicing cheese, okay? The reason people have a hard time slicing cheese is because you're cutting it on a cutting board where you don't have any control. With the Clever Cutter, you can do it as thick or as thin as you like you so can be funny. you can go as fast or as precise as you like but I mean talk about getting the job done quick and instead of having one side thick one side thin you know when you're using it on a cutting board with the knife slips out of the cheese now you can do a whole block of cheese in a matter of seconds and get every slice perfect and uniform and it's and a lot cheaper to buy block cheese than it is pre-cut oh, cheese yeah. save yourself some money by the way you're getting two so you get two of the clever, clever cutters and then you get two of the the sleeves that you, which yes. you can, we'll show you that in just a second. Plus, you get a really nice peeler with this. I know. I so show you if that peeler too. That thing's great. Foodie, anybody who's in the kitchen, anybody who has to cook, wants to cook, or doesn't like to cook, they are going to love this. In fact, the reviews are awesome. Yeah. On this. Well, it, the thing is, it saves you so much time. Once you start using the clever cutter, you're going to use it for everything. Right, I mean, keep right. it right in your knife drawer. Hey, listen, when you see it every day, you'll use it every day. How about some chicken for home, uh, for, for chicken fajitas Good or idea. steak fajitas? It'll do all the all your cooked uh, meats and cheese and look at this I mean perfect slices for your fajitas I mean this knife is so sharp literally you could cut a cow in half <laughs> and that's no 
no bull. <laughs> and I wouldn't steer you wrong. Oh, but whoa, whoa, whoa. I, but, Sorry, am I milking okay. it? Here, look at this. All oh you do gosh. is squeeze the handle, and it... <laughs> we should put that one out to pasture, that was don't you think? <laughs> I mean, that was utterly terrible. Oh, Here, watch God. this. All you do... That was six in a row. That <laughs> was pretty good. <laughs> oh, I tell you. Here, you can cut literally everything with this. Here, we're slicing apples for apple pie. Right into an... On, on, over the top of an omelet. Oh, all yeah. of your veggies. Here's the chicken again. I mean, perfect for for fajitas and again it's a razor blade on a handle I okay it, it comes the with the cutting board too the oh yeah it's great. great for herbs how about we're cutting vegetables right into a soup pot and it's got the power that's the thing because of that dual hinge design watch this i'm going to take this avocado okay and we all know there's a pit inside of an avocado but i'm going to slice this <laughs> open to show you look it'll oh. cut right through the pit and everything so you can slice an avocado in half right through the pit it's that razor sharp german stainless steel blade that does the work for you. That is so and, smart. I mean, whether you're making pan fries, home fries, raw fries, American fries, cottage fries, whatever you want to call them, look, when they're sliced even in uniform, they're going to cook up even in uniform. You know, and the, the best part about this too, maybe you don't want whole slices like that. Take a vegetable, cut it down the lengthwise like this, or you can even cut it this way to quarter it down, and now when you slice it, mm. perfect for pan fry, or for, uh, for your uh, uh, fried potatoes for in the morning, for yep. breakfast potatoes. Right, right. I mean, you can do so much with the Clever Cutter, and again, uh, for soups and stews, the power of this, look this at this. Is, that's what surprised me, Here's the corn. A, if you want to cut, you can uh, cut corn in half. This is stuff that's hard to do with a knife, and I'm doing it with the Clever Cutter because you're taking that cutting board to the knife instead of the knife to the cutting board. Right, I right. mean, it just makes sense. For delicate things, maybe you want to do things like uh, 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 a... That's a Brussels sprout. Yeah, Brussels it? sprout. Thank you. I was I was actually thinking I of do, garlic I cloves, you know, which well, I've actually, done. That, which, would look good. that, that would works work. good too. Yeah. But, I mean, uh, radishes over the top of a oh, salad. Oh, I like your mushrooms. Oh, yeah, mushrooms. Delicate things like mushrooms, but you can even do do uh, you know precise slices with this each and every time because. It's, you have the control. Yeah. That dual hinge design gives you the power, but you have the control. Right. And I mean, wouldn't it be nice to go right to your soup pot and do celery and carrots right at the same time right into the pot of soup. Instead right. of doing this on the cutting board where you've got the cleanup, now it does, it's, I mean, it saves you so much time. It really is brilliant. <laughs> it's like very And it's smart. so simple to use. Uh, by the way, we've now sold almost 2,700. I have a little under 2,000 left. And I just want to show you the configuration. Everybody gets two of these. Now also, this is really clever. This yes. is the um, uh, sleeve. And what the sleeve does is you can actually stick it down yeah. behind it. On the back the door. of this, yeah. on the back of this, I'll show you, it's got a peel and stick. So you peel this off, you can put it on the on the inside of a cabinet door and then, so when the door is closed it's on the inside when you open the cabinet door it's on the outside and, right and down, the clever right? cutter it fits right inside the caddy so now so it's you have ready it, when you so are so it's ready when you are right and then also and, you get the peeler yes this peeler and i got to show you this because and I'll, I'll tell you what this peeler is twice as fast as any other peeler you've ever used. Look at this. It cuts in both directions. So it peels one direction, okay, and it peels the other direction. Uh -huh. So whether you're right-handed or left-handed, you get the peeling done twice as fast, whether it's beets, apples, carrots, pears, potatoes, whatever you're peeling. And you can do fancy things like uh, garnishing too, because you can make those uh, fancy carrot strips. You can do the fancy ribbons with this, however you want to do it. I mean, it does way more work than a regular peeler, but it does it quick, safe, fast, and easy. I mean, zucchini, carrots, apples, pears, whatever you want to peel with this peel. Look at this. Perfect slices for Great. fried zucchini. And that's actually, <laughs> or for garnishing and, a salad. And that's included as well. So keep one for yourself, keep the peeler for yourself, and give the other one away. And again, you get the two sleeves. Um, yes. Don't forget, we also have FlexPay on this, which is great. And we're shipping this for free. This is one of those items I would get multiples to. Because you know, John, yeah. as you get closer to the holidays, you start to freak out. What do I give somebody? They're right. hard to buy for. Right. This is great for a guy. It's for a gal. Uh, it's for anybody moving to the first home. Anybody that does any amount of any, cooking. Yeah, if you have somebody that maybe has dexterity, problems, they, they have a hard time using a knife in the kitchen, maybe they're afraid of using a knife in the kitchen because, let's face it, knives are sharp, they're dangerous because they're sharp, and dull knives are actually more dangerous than a sharp knife That's because right. you have to force it through the food. This razor sharp German stainless steel blade with the cutting board <laughs> included with it, I mean it comes together like this, look at this, soft fresh bread easily cut with the, with the clever cutter, and again, it locks closed, dishwasher safe, pop it in the in the in the utility rack of the dishwasher or 
Uh, or you can rinse it off by hand, and it comes with that caddy, Easy. so all you do is slide it in, put the, stick this on the, on the outside of your fridge, maybe, sure. or on the inside of a cabinet door, so when the door is closed, it's on the inside. And guys, when I can see, open, it's you can really, it does the work for you. Yeah. You can see, see I'm using this, and what's really nice is the minute you open it up, no one will ever know it was, what, maybe about $12? You know, right. I mean, right. they will, they'll think it's a much more expensive item. You can really feel the quality of yeah. it when it, you hold it, Once too. you That's use really this once, easy. like I, I tell everybody, I once you use it once, you won't be without it. Ooh, I mean, here's a goodie. A lot, a lot of the backstage folks here, okay, the, yeah. the guys that run the cameras and yeah. do all the stage work, they they have these. They love. Oh, them. I mean, look at this. the thing is, when you it'll wow. slice. You can slice onions so fast you won't even have time to cry. I mean, think <laughs> think about the time that you save. And look here's that. oh yeah, you're doing it right into the soup pot. Yeah, why here, not? try this at home too. If you don't want to slice, maybe you want to dice. Take an onion, make a couple of slices into it this way, okay. And now when you slice it this way, you're going to actually dice your onion instead of slice it for uh, for homemade stuffing, for soups and stews. Oh, my gosh. I mean, look at this there's jalapeno. so many things that you can do. You guys, do look how look fast I'm doing the jalapeno. I know. <laughs> that gets really fast. That is really surprising. It's, it's absolutely, it's so easy to use. And even for something here, try a carrot in there. Okay. I mean, I don't know if you've tried carrots or no. not, but oh. I mean, and whether it's at the tip of the knife or all the way back That's to the a, heel you of the knife. Carrots typically yeah, are like sawing away on It takes the work out of look cooking. That. It's wow. so quick, safe, fast, and easy. Here's some leeks. Oh look, my let me gosh, snip the end that. off of this Even leek. Even that big, thick part. I know. Yeah, I mean, doing leeks into your salad, soups or stews. Yeah, I mean, le leeks are great in a salad or soup. Mm -hmm. uh, they're not so great on a boat, but they're great in a stew <laughs> or a soup. Look at this. You can, do, you can do sideways cuts like this if you want to dice your leeks instead of slice them into circles like that. Because the leeks grow in rings like that, you can slice them up. And look at that. You get perfectly diced leeks you know right into a, a soup You know what a really pot. good idea is anybody, if you work with a lot of herbs you know if you love working with all these fresh herbs and you get them at the grocery store you pick them out i love that because you can cut yeah. these really right it's off. almost like yeah. trim, it, uh, trim it a bush <laughs> i know you know what i mean and, and it comes again, right off look at you've that. got the power here's that avocado again here's another avocado look we're going to slice that right through the pit That's i mean crazy. it cuts the pit and all <laughs> all right here's the story we've now sold 3200 we've got about a thousand left stay on the line for that coming up next we have one of my favorite christmas gift ideas john thanks yes thank Amy's you he's here to give you a peek at our today special. <laughs> Okay, we've got a big night of fashion and function. That's right, Sporto Boots is here with an incredible HSN exclusive today special as they're celebrating 40 years of their number one all-time bestseller. Everybody knows the duck boot, right? Well, imagine they gave you a taller shaft, genuine leather, genuine suede, and imagine all waterproof. We've got five stunning colors, black, chestnut, merlot, olive, or the winter white. We also have this in medium and wide sizes. So think about keeping your tootsies nice and warm because guess what? We've got a way for you to get this home today under what, $17? Think about that, $16.99. This is well over a hundred and some dollar boot. We're saving you $54 now. So celebrate in style, fashion and function all come together tonight with Sporto, an amazing today special. So don't wait till the snow starts to fall because you won't find these anywhere else but here. And they are so cute. I'm actually going to post a picture of them. I'm going to model them tomorrow and put it on Facebook. And I'll rejoin to wrap up tomorrow's event with Sporto Boots. And they are absolutely adorable. And they work. They're like super hardworking as well. All right. So there are a few things here at HSN that throughout the season um, have become host picks, including this has been mine several times and has sold out every single time we put it on the air. And the Clever Grip is one of those. I have been on several nights in a row. And every night I go, can I have Clever Grip? again and they're like well okay it's because I use it and I love it and last season I literally bought five sets 10 of them to give away to my family and my friends because it's such a smart idea if you've got a cell phone and you drive a car you really need to have this and you understand why in just a moment here's what we did this year unlike last year we had and sold two per package we've now tripled it for the first time but clearly have not tripled the price we also have two flex pays we've got free shipping and only while they last and for the holiday season we've already sold 13,000 sets and that is almost halfway through everything we have for the entire holiday something else we did that's so brand new and I love this is we really made it gift ready last year you just kind of had the you know the packaging you'd see in a store kind of the clam packs now this year you have matching decorative boxes to go with the set of three that you're picking up so I love the fact you get the boxes 
to go along with it as well. So we've tripled them. We've added the boxes, did not triple the price. You're choosing the black, the red, the silver, or the gold. And Lou Caputo rejoins me to explain just how brilliant this is. <laughs> May I? Uh, oh, I took your You took mine. I gave her mine. I'm like, here, use this one. Is there a spare? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to show up tomorrow night. I've decided now. <laughs> Are you? Every night in a row. No. Well, here's why. Because this, this is one of those products that we sell where everybody asks me about this. Yes. After they see it, everybody wants to know. And when you look at it, you kind of go like, eh, what is it? Okay, this might be the best cell phone holder you're ever going to use. First of all, it has a very wide mouth. There are two nice soft rubber grips on the sides right here. You put your cell phone in here, and it expands. It has a metal spring inside, and it expands to the size of your phone. And this will fit the absolute largest phone that's on the market right now. No problem. Android, Apple, it doesn't matter. On the back of it, it has these fins right here that fit onto the air conditioning duct of your car. So you just put it on there. I don't care if they're round, triangular, square, triangular, well, whatever shape. It doesn't matter. They're going to fit there. And then you can rotate the phone. So if I take the giant cell phone I have here, this is just like the kind Suzanne has, a uh, Note, Note 4. I have a 4, Note 4 big with a phone. case around it. Big, this has a case too with our friend on it. His phone has a friend, a picture of Adam. Oh, please. I'm a fan. When do I rank I'm getting the back fan. of your phone? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, never, anyway. Never. Talk about sucking up. Oh, okay, that's all oh. I'm saying. He gives pins. Okay, watch this. <laughs> uh, it fits right inside like this. It expands, and the phone fits inside of it. And you can do that. I've done this thousands of times with the one in my vehicle, okay? And the nice thing is, once it's in there, guys, it's in there. Now, you know how much you paid for your phone, right? Yes, okay, it's a lot of money, okay? Right, right. To do this with a phone is crazy, but here's why I'm doing it. So many of us have bought inferior cell phone holders before. You know what I'm talking oh, about? Oh, yeah. The kind yeah. that have the suction cups. Which that, never work. They never no, last. No, because the sun, the suction goes away, they fall. Plus, in, in Florida anyway, you're not supposed to put anything on your windshield that obscures your view. Okay? Definitely it does that. The kind with the bean bags. This is such a better system. And the nice thing about this is where it puts it. Because on your air conditioning duct, it's right about the same level as your speedometer. So, you're glancing down at that. You're looking at the fuel gauge. This is about at that same level. So, it's not like you're looking down into your cup holder or down into the palm of your hand. And or while you're driving down the seat exactly. and you're trying to dig for it and you're looking down there because somebody's like you're trying to find some direction here's what's interesting once you start using this if you don't have it it'll drive you crazy when you don't have it <laughs> it is my husband stole mine out of our car my car the other day and i didn't know i don't know why i know why he took it now but he just took it and i go into my car and i use it consistently like i said earlier if you go to my car right now in the parking lot here at hsn you will see a gold version sitting right there in my air conditioning vent i use it every time i sit in the car um even if I'm just driving and like a text pops, pops up, we know, don't take your hands off the wheel. Don't even reach down. Don't even attempt to do that. But I can glance over very quickly and see if it's somebody's calling that's important or if I really need to pull over and make the call or answer that text. You will love it. But the minute it's gone, when my husband took it the other day, I was like, really kind of freaked out about it. I'm like, who took my clever grip? Because you get so used to having it right there, yep. Yep. and it's right there at the perfect angle so you can see your GPS as well. Yeah, it's almost as bad as leaving your home without your cell phone at all, because we've all done that, and you know how you feel naked. You're like, yeah. well, I, I, I don't know what to do now. It's so true. When I drive the vehicle without the clever grip, that's how I feel, because now all of a sudden, I have to reach for my phone if somebody calls to see who's calling me, or I like to stream my music, yeah. okay, using the Bluetooth, to my stereo in my car. Well, you know, maybe I want to skip a song, okay? I don't want to wait till the next traffic light to have to skip the song, especially if it's one that I hate. So I can actually hit the button on the phone. And that's the other thing too. A lot of times, if you have to use your cell phone for whatever reason, it's a two-hand situation. I can't reach everywhere on this phone with my thumb, okay? But when it's mounted to the air conditioning vent, it's very simple. Speaking of which, take a look at the vents we have in front of us here, just to show you not only how it fits on any style of vent. And as I was saying earlier, I don't care if you've got like a big long one like this, you've got round one like we have up here, it doesn't matter, it's gonna fit. And the way it fits is simplicity itself. All you do is, you know, your phone's gonna be out, you just put your phone inside of it like that, you pick a spot where you wanna put it, and you just press, and it holds it right there. If I wanna change the angle on the phone, it rotates just like that, and it'll hold it. So sometimes when I'm listening to music, I like to be in portrait mode. Sometimes when I'm doing um, the GPS and the, uh, the nav system, I wanna have it in landscape mode. So it just depends on whatever you wanna do. But look at all the array of phones on here. We've got everything from iPhone, phones to Android phones to a BlackBerry. This down here is an old school GPS. And I say old school because a lot of people use the nav systems on their car, but that's a full size GPS that's sitting on there. And it holds that in place as well. So you don't have the bean bag sitting on the dashboard. Um, and I'll tell you the spring, really last. Oh, yeah. Like I have taken my phone in and out of my clever grip 
thousands of times and the darn thing still holds beautifully it still retains its tension and here's another little quirky thing can i borrow yours yeah absolutely Here, borrow mine one. we only have one <laughs> we're a gazillion dollar company and we've got one for us to share i don't know i want to see see this the fin he was talking about yep. a lot of times if this is just plastic because you take it on and off so often it would get wimpy and weak it doesn't no for some bizarre reason it's so well made that this actually always holds the grip perfectly and yet it's still simple to put it on and off does that make sense well you know what it is it's a really high grade rubber that they use yeah, so that so that it is both stiff and pliable if that makes same sense time. at the same time yeah. so it is going to be malleable enough so that it can get between those vents without breaking anything okay see how they wide they can get and then they come together again so as many times as I do that but they're also going to hold that phone in there nice and securely yes. and don't forget that same rubber that's on the back here is also what's actually holding the phone in place so when I take it out and I do this Look at that, it's not going to go anywhere. So this is the kind of gift that, you know what, if you've been giving people socks every year, first of all, <laughs> stop it, okay? Get them something that they want. And this- No, wait, get them something they won't expect, yes. but they'll really love it once you do it. use it, and they'll that's really the thing. Use it, yeah. Well, and the nice thing, we make it so simple for you. We give you the boxes, the matching colors of the gift box to yes. whatever color you buy. And, so, and one for real. each one of these. So, so you're getting three, so you're gonna get three gift boxes. You know, so for all the secret Santas out there, you know, where they tell you don't spend, spend less than $20, what are you gonna get for less than 20 bucks? Yeah. We can get three of these. Yeah. Well, not less than 20 bucks, we're just over. Yeah, but they, oh, divide, what is it, what is it? What About is eight it? bucks a piece. $8 yeah. a piece. And, yeah. and, and I'm telling you, everyone will call you up later and go, I didn't get, they'll open it up and go, what? Because it's really weird when you first see it. You're like, I don't know what this thing does. And they'll start using it. And then they'll call you back and say, oh my gosh, I love that. Here's how I could prove that too. Um, I gave these out to everybody on my list last year. I gave Blackhawk pens, which we have in stock now. <laughs> and I gave out these because there were multiples. So I bought a lot of them, right? And I gave it to my son at that point. He was 18. And my nephew's in his 20s. And do you know, and guys aren't impressed by much. They like stuff, but they don't ever call you and say, you know, that was really a good gift. Never. Do you know both? my son and my nephew called me back and said I love it and my son's younger and I don't want anybody being distracted as a driver he loves to lift his do his music so he plugs it in he plugs in the cord to his system and you know what he was looking down to change his music all the time because oh, he bad. does it always now I know he's driving safer because he just has to go like this to change his music then my nephew called and he said you know that thing is such a great gift yeah. and it is it's an easy quick answer it's for the gang at work it's for your book club do you have the book club for me I've got my tennis girls maybe you want to get a bunch of people you love a really neat little gift it's perfect for that i use it as the second gift you know how yeah. if you only give one to a family member it's like yeah it doesn't seem like enough right so i added the pen to it and then i added a clever grip to it and then it felt like i was giving a nicer amount of gifts and, and they're both awesome and the thing is that if you are a, a parent or a grandparent or an aunt or an uncle you owe it to yourself to give it to those younger people yes. in the family that are just yes. starting to drive because you know no matter how many times you tell them not to they're going to yeah. okay so give it to them so that they're at least the phone's going to be in a safe place when they're using it now here's a little trick that i like to do right here this is kind of a neat thing you can take a room key a credit card or anything stick it in the back of this and suddenly it becomes a table stand so you know we were talking last night about how my wife kelly likes to uh, get recipes off pinterest she's got the big iphone and she will sit there and have it uh, actually on the counter so she can look at it and scroll through it and it holds it like that uh, if you want to use it at your work so you can see who's calling getting text messages at the office the other thing i like to show people too is this if you just turn it sideways like that it'll stand oops do it the right way Lou there we go stand like this so if you want to watch movies in this aspect ratio on a plane on the tray table so you don't pay like the crazy amount of money they want to rent your headphones you can watch your own movie um, for the kids in the back seat of the car yeah. if you want to give it to them let them set it up on a table back there so you know it's very very versatile product not just for in the vehicle you can use it in the office or anywhere else you also, want also if you go to a rental car too you've got a strange car oh. you're not familiar with it you will regret not having this with you and once you start using it when you've don't have it you'll be like oh my gosh it just doesn't feel right yeah you just feel so awkward and uncomfortable um so it's an awesome time to get it we have a set of three that's new this year and the new boxes to match are brand new last year we didn't offer that and yet we didn't triple the price on these so free shipping tonight you've got two flex pays i highly highly recommend get multiples because right now we are about a thousand away from officially being halfway through our quantity for the entire holiday season and we haven't hit Thanksgiving yet. <laughs> so you might really want to think about it tonight. And then get that, get the stocking stuffer list done. You're yeah. done. You, teacher's gifts. <gasps> oh, that's a good idea. Best Great idea. teacher gift Look at this thing. ever, ever, ever. Isn't that awesome? It just holds it so well. All right, Lou, we're going to wrap it up. All righty, right so tomorrow okay. night? Here's, tomorrow <laughs> night. I'll be here tomorrow <laughs> evening.
You elect to watch us. <laughs> you like that one, huh? Oh, I like this one. Yeah. Cast your vote for a Sporto boot. <laughs> Very I'm nice. working on a million of them before tomorrow. I heard John evening. earlier, yeah. No. Yeah. yeah, no, 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 this were bad. All right, stay on the line for that. Now 14,100 already ordered. It's just that easy, it's just that convenient. You really will love it, and it is the perfect little extra gift. And maybe it's to, you know, the mailman or the neighbor or someone who walks your dog for you or, or you know, um, checks, keeps your eye on your house while you're vacationing. It really is a simply clever, really smart gift idea. Okay, coming up next, Bordeaux Boots. Winter's coming and we've got the perfect fashionable answer. All right, it's Gifting Tuesday here at HSN, and we always look forward to when Sporto has their big today special of the year. We have something exclusive. We have something waterproof. It is fun, functional, and fabulous. Here it is, our Best Buy of the Day. our brand new today special from Sporto. It's their waterproof suede and leather duck boot. I want you to take a look at the retail price because Sporto is a brand that is known worldwide for using amazing luxury materials. They're durable, you can't kill them. People have had them for decades upon decades. And of course, now they're known for their exclusive styles to us here at HSN. This is a family owned company and has been for over five decades. And they bring to us their most iconic style, which is the duck boot.